Hey, what's up everybody? This is Brian over here at the Little Orchard Farm. Today, well, today's a really cool day. We've got something really special planned. My cousin Mike, um, he's been helping me try to get internet connectivity out at the farm. And we've had some mixed results. I've really been wanting to create a, um, uh, a video on our internet setup, which for the most part, I'm pretty pleased with, but I'm not getting the kind of results that I'd like to be getting. And so, Mike has been scouring for um, an antenna, uh, a tower antenna, and we've, we've come across one. He picked it up for free. It's uh, about a 40 foot, um, probably gonna be about 45 feet maybe in total. And so I'm following him in right now as we uh, ran to get a few supplies this morning. But uh, we're going to unload this thing and we're going to um, try to get it in the ground. We got a lot to do. Let's do this. I figured this was the easiest way to... Yeah, towed it. From moving. I wasn't sure if. Uh... So you said that this is three 10 foot sections and then about a nine foot section. And another three foot. And another three foot section. And then we went and purchased a 10 foot post that will sit on the top that the uh, antennas will. Well, a fix to. <laughs> it loosens up. Loosens the release. Let me see that, right? I'm gonna, I'm gonna try this. Do a bowling. Okay. Look at it this way. Go there. Yep. And just flip it over. Yeah. Oh, you you do it back at it. Yeah, well, I'm left. Backwards. I, I'm <laughs> <laughs> oh, you got. Now, when you flip that, see if it's I can do it. It's the same way. Let's see if I can do it left handed. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's better. Yeah. 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 Shoot you, I'm telling wow. you. Wow. The more you pull, the tighter it gets. That's awesome. So the way that we've kind of thought through this is this pole here at the top is where the antennas will sit. Uh, but Mike has kind of figured out a, a mast system, if you will, to where we can lower the mast. And so we bought a collar and we're just gonna tighten that collar up against the pole and then the pole can then lower all the way down to that point and it'll, it'll act as a catch or a stop. And, uh, and that way the antennas won't hit the, uh, the topper, which is what this is called. It's called a topper. And so it'll it'll slide all the way down to all the way down to here, and that stop will hit right here, and then and you'll see that here in just a second. When you're forty foot in the air, <laughs> yeah, yeah. When you're forty foot in the air, you want to bring this down as much as you can. So he just saved ten foot essentially, and bringing this all the way down to where it hits the hits here. All right. So the whole goal of this is to get height. Uh, what we were finding with my setup here is that when I put the my Yagi antennas uh, at the top of the apex of the house, it just wasn't wasn't quite getting enough. Uh, the apex of the cabin is about 22 feet or so in the air, and 
I need to be I need to be clear as you can see the apex of the cabin but then I've got these these other trees which are really close to the house those probably won't hurt me as bad as all the rest of all the rest of these trees particularly this really really big one I don't know if you can see it through here but that big one right there is in direct line with the cell tower that I'm trying to hit so the idea is to get the antenna as high as we possibly can get it and that provides some that'll provide us with some uh, with some line of sight to that cell tower All right, so we've got the we've got the antenna assembled, the tower, and uh, we've got a two by six board here at the hole. The hole is a little over three foot deep, and so the plan would be is to pull this up and have the board guided in. We're actually going to try to walk it by hand up. And we're going to have the tractor attached to the other end of it by rope in case we need a little assistance. So Karen's going to be the master tractor driver. Mike and I are going to try to walk us. It should be very interesting. <laughs> very interesting. <laughs> Just make sure, just make sure we put the level on this side, see where we at.
We pretty good. Yep. All right. I'll just hold it right here till she gets back. He's got one, baby. I ain't got no rubber rubber glove. It's all right. I ain't gonna need no rubber glove. Oh yeah, nice sunshine. We like about you. Well, all right, Mike is on his way out and we have completed setting the antenna, the tower. Whew. Got the uh, got the concrete poured, packed down in there. It's setting up, got dirt poured on top of it, packed it down. Whew. Let's walk out here and we'll talk about it a little bit and get in the shade. So the way that that stands right now is that antenna sticks up um, about 20. Once we expand, uh, extend the, uh, the pole at the top, it'll be right at 28, 29 feet above the apex of the house, of the cabin. So that puts us up in line or essentially up high enough to begin to get line of sight above these trees where I have the... Um, where I have the uh, Yagi's now, which are right over here, right on the porch line, essentially. I did have them up here, but uh, we've moved them down here. Uh, we were seeing no performance increase or decrease on the, um, uh, on the upload or download by moving it just that, that little bit. But moving it from, from up here all the way up to here, now we're talking. So we're going to get the Yagi's up right at... It'll be close to 50 feet. Um, yeah, it'll be close to 50 feet. It should be around 50 feet uh, in the air. And that should give us plenty of line of sight that goes yonder ways uh, over to where the cell tower is. And then I can bring you my full turnkey solution on how I got rural internet out to our cabin and hopefully i'm getting excellent performance from the devices right now like i said we're probably getting between 12 and 20 down depending on the time of day the weather wind blah 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 between 12 and, and uh, 20 down which again it's not that bad for one person or for two people rather we can do what we need to do or want to do in the evening watch youtube watch TV, uh, Netflix, uh, surf the web, whatever, you know. I mean, that's plenty of bandwidth to do that. Um, but the upload, if I tried to go and upload a video to YouTube right now, it would take like five to six hours, which is ridiculous. It's less than one up, one mega. 
So we want to increase that. We want to get that to around that five to seven range, uh, which I think would be excellent and would serve us well here. Um, and maybe getting this will do it. We'll see. For anyway, there you have it. Got the antenna, the tower anyway. So that's going to do it. You guys have a wonderful week. Very blessed week. Till we see you again the next time. We will. See ya.